Hey everybody, I wanted to do a quick video on some things I discovered with WLED for lighting. Uh, just to give you a quick idea of what, what the problem I was having. I've added some lights to some crown molding in the house. And it's a small Diguno with uh, 100 Ferry lights, single addressable. Same thing as the other lights that are in this video playlist that I have, but my wife wants them to still color up on the holidays, but she wants them to be white, and I actually want it too because it's a good idea. She wants it to be white at night, so it could be like a night light when you're walking through the house. Um, some of the issues I was having was creating these playlists. <clears throat> Don't give you the option to switch from one playlist to another. Uh, another option is duration, how long the lights want to stay on. Uh, you can set that up with the going into time and macros. You can set up a time control preset so that you can set your preset to come on at a certain time and date. And then shut off whenever you want it to shut off. Um, like, for instance, I have this at uh, 7 o'clock because it's all 24-hour time. This is Halloween, the holiday, that, that period. And at 7 o'clock, I want the Halloween lights to come on. That's a different preset. I have 11 in here, but that's what I'm going to explain. I had a different preset. For Halloween so if I go back here you have this preset for Halloween which is preset 4 but 11 is a playlist for Halloween which I'm going to explain because on if I go to an outside light because this right now that I'm looking at is for the crown molding if I go to an outside light uh, let's see like this here is the west side of my house I don't have those playlists because I don't need them. They shut off completely when the timer is done and then the house isn't lit up all night. But with this crown molding, I want it to light back up with what I create here, a default white, when one of these presets isn't running. So here's how this works. So in the other video, I explained that you have to have an off preset. Um, if you know how to do the HTTP or API programming stuff that's like in the this stuff here, you might be able to figure out how to do a duration so that the lights would shut off automatically. I don't know how to do that. So I never bothered to really try to figure it out. Well, I tried to figure it out, but... I'm not a programmer, so I started to get a little overwhelmed with trying to figure out, figure out how to get that done. So uh, I was hitting some people up on Discord, and somebody came up with an idea and said, use a, pl a playlist. Uh, there is a problem with it, but I'll show you. So let's say I want to make a playlist for 4th of July for my crown molding. What I want is at... Um, seven o'clock at night when it starts getting dark i want the fourth of july to come on during a certain time frame that i have set up here in my macros uh the fourth of july here it is right here fourth of july at uh, 12 o'clock it comes on i don't know why i have it set at 12 uh anyhow 12 o'clock it'll come on and it will use the 4th of July preset for outside. For this one though, I created a playlist which would be 12 right here, 4th of July. So that will come on at 12 o'clock based on the, the timer or the, uh, the time setting that I created for it. And then it'll run for however much time I want it to run. Uh, and then it'll shut off, and then I want it to go back to white. 
at night because at night I want to have that night light. Now you have this timer here, which you can set under LED preferences. You go down to, uh, where is it? Timed light duration. And this is a, um, like a night light. So when I hit this button and turn that on, the light comes on. See, it active for 60 seconds. Uh, but right now I don't have it on. If I have it on and then turn it on, then you'll see that it'll come on. So now the light is on and it will be on for 60 seconds or how long did that? 60 minutes. And then it will shut off automatically. Now you can increase that time. Uh, but you have to you have to manually turn that on and off when you want to do a night light. Uh, as far as I know, I'm, I'm not sure of exactly if you can set a specific timer for it to happen at a certain time each night, but the, it just says duration. So I'm not sure how that works, but anyhow. So what you got to do is you got to create a playlist. And what's great about a playlist, let me put, click on new playlist is you can create quick labels if you want. Quick labels just show up up here as a quick button you hit, but I mean, you hit this button too, if you want to turn it on. I don't understand the difference. Um, so I don't even use the quick load labels, but you select here 4th of July of what entries you want to play. Now you can automatically rotate other presets that you have. If you wanted to bounce to a different sequence, you can create a whole sequence of, of presets and then how much you want them to play and uh, the transition time. And then you can shuffle it and have it keep going over and over and over again with this repeat indefinitely or shuffle the, shuffle the presets all over the place, however you want to do it. I don't want to do that. So I'll turn off repeat indefinitely I'll turn off shuffle and then I'll turn here and I'll set my uh where's it at? default white here it is I'll set my default white as the preset it will go to once this sequence is done here's the problem I found this 6553 is the highest duration that you can do 6,553 minutes, which is weird, but it's a little less than two hours. It's like 1.8 hours. Uh, I want this to do for like five hours. So until they make some kind of change or unless I can figure out how to do it longer, I'm stuck with like 1.8 hours. Uh, hopefully they can get this duration, maybe add another one for minutes and seconds and then i can do 500 or 300 minutes and that'll give me five hours but for the time being i got 6553 seconds <laughs> so um, then all you do is you save it i give it a name here we'll call it uh for july so i already have a july 4th and then i'll save it so now I have this four, four July pre, uh, playlist. And then what I'll do is I'll come into time macros and I'll set my 4th of July to that preset number. Uh, if I go back, whatever that preset number was 15. So I would set that to 15 and save it. And then now what will happen is at whatever time I have this set, I don't know why it's set to 12. It should be for July. It should be like nine o'clock at night. Not sure why that was at 12 hours. It might have, this is a new LED string that I set up. So when I copied it over, it might've been, might've copied over wrong. Let me see what these other ones look like. It should say, yeah, 2100. 
So it might have just been something that happened when it got copied over. But so now, at 2100, that playlist will come on. It will play 4th of July lights for 6,553 seconds. When it shuts off, it will automatically switch over to white. And then, in the time macros, I have a sunset turned on so that and sun or sunrise sorry sunrise set up and I have the macro or the preset for off set on that so every morning when this thing uh, determines when sun sunrise is which I have I have uh, used 24 hour format format use NTP get my location I went ahead and set that when it recognizes sunrise at 742, it'll shut the light off. I still have to make sure this works. I haven't really fully tested it. Uh, that's going to run tonight. So we'll have to see. So somebody did come up with an idea on Discord that if you just, since this only goes up to 1.8 hours, just run it three times. That'll give me a little more than five hours of runtime. And then drop to white for the rest of the night as a night light. I'm hoping, I suggested in Discord, that they add a minute to the playlist. And then that way I'll get I'll be able to get more time to stretch this out. So if you have an idea of uh getting this to work better or you have the syntax to add it to api or http i would appreciate you comment below and let me know what would be the best way to do this as of right now i'm stuck with using playlist uh, because i'm not i'm not that savvy on that programming stuff so it's not exactly something that uh i know how to do but if you have suggestions critiques let me know i'm all in for i'm all ears to uh some better ideas to get this work better hopefully maybe if there if they don't if there isn't another idea this will help somebody else watching on how to get this done if you have any questions hit me up subscribe talk to you later